What does the Bible say about love? The Bible tells us that God first is love. And so as we understand what love is, we come to understand who God ultimately is by his nature. Um, and there's a few ways in which the Bible calls us to love. We were called to love God, to love our spouse if we are married, and then to love our neighbor in a particular kind of way. And we might understand this love as a giving of ourselves for their good and for their flourishing as a person. It moves beyond just a feeling or a kind of a short lasting emotion, but is an, an action, a whole person in which the, the total self, your total self is given over to somebody else for their good and for their flourishing in the way that God loves us. And he gives of himself through Jesus uh, so that we can experience life, uh, be forgiven and changed. In that same way, we express that love to our spouse if we're married. And then we also give that kind of love to our neighbor, regardless of where they're at or regardless of what they might give to us, right? There's an opportunity for us to love people without conditions. And so it very much is this movement of the total self for the good of someone else uh, through sacrifice, um, through giving, uh, through time spent, right? Through presence and personal relationships. Those are all powerful ways in which we can demonstrate love towards someone else. Here at Sandals Church, we really do believe that this vision of being real can change the world. Because Sandals Church is a nonprofit that operates from donations from people like you. Because when you donate, your money goes to creating places for people to be real all over this world. So man, I would love for you to be a part of that and you can make a donation today by clicking the link on this video or going to donate.se. So join us and join what God is doing through this vision of being real and have a great day.